panda. Yeah. I got brides in Atlanta. <laughs> she took the lead in the family. <laughs> Credit cards in the scammers. <laughs> Getting the licks in the band. Legacy. All right, coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight showdown. Well, he's one of the more accomplished strikers in this division. Sprawl and brawl, whatever you want to say, he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. It does not matter how he accomplishes it. All he wants to do is be on his feet and at range, hitting you with the beautiful jab, staying away from the grappling exchanges. You don't accomplish all the things that this man has accomplished over the course of his career without understanding distance. He has great distance management, which then in turn allows him to land all these beautiful diverse kicks, spinning back kick, jumping high kick, so many things he possesses that he will try to use tonight in this fight. Yeah, if this turns into a kickboxing match tonight, most it's people over. believe, yeah, his opponent is in a it's world over, of trouble. Well, this guy has truly made the takedown a thing of beauty in mixed martial arts. With respect to yourself and George St. Pierre and the truly great takedown artists, this guy's closing the gap and, and entering that company in the eyes of men. Oh, absolutely, because he's done such a great job of timing takedowns. You didn't see, I haven't seen anyone so good at slipping a jab into a takedown since George St. Pierre. Right. He does a phenomenal job of getting through step one to step two before his opponent even realizes, now he's in on my leg. And if they do get their hip back, immediately he's up into a foot sweep, or a headlock, or an inside trip. It's just so many different ways for him to get you to the floor that he will throw every single one at you every single time. And a lot of fighters talk about that wrestling maintenance and how hard it is, right, over the course of a career to continue to drill those things. He talks a lot about that, and that's why he's continued to realize success here in the U.S. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Prudential Center in Newark, New Jersey. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet five inches tall, weighing in at 206 pounds. Fighting out of Lakewood, Colorado, USA, Silky. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet ten inches tall, weighing in at 178 pounds. Fighting out of Moscow, Russia, invincible. Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your car. Up. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but maybe not. This is a big time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is going to be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big time athletes? That right hand landed. Well, we talked about his reach advantage off the top. Made good use of it there with that punch, DC. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Wow. 
clash with the taller fighter lands a knee, and Daniel Cormier to my right, I can hear him saying, I wish I was a little bit taller. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Blocks the shot. Oh, he lands a big left hand. Superman punch now. Oh! Straight punch land. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Under three minutes remain in round one. Nice leg kick. Nice jab there. He told us on Thursday he wanted to break this dude's nose. That is certainly a step in the right direction. Mission accomplished. Ah. You are battering that nose. And now he's hurt. That's one of those shots. And if you take one of them, if you end the night, that will land it right on the spot. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering. Nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. Real quick leg kick. Sniff that one out as he blocks the kick. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. the shot. Just unable to quite find that range. It's okay. Ooh, use your Powerful leg kick lands. Oh, lands a stiff punch there. Nice connection. Oh, nice land. Fighter making noise with a knee strike there. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Look at the whip action that comes from throwing that kick. Well, you see him land the jab there. He's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. I mean, he's cutting them down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Oh, a huge strike lands there, DC. He landed that massive shot. Now he needs to try to find the next shot, the follow-up shot that will finish the fight. Beautiful kick. Final second to round one. Oh, he's been working hard defensively. Kick block there. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays, DC, and if you like the kicking game, that was the round for you. Yeah, man, he used his kicks beautifully. He managed distance, managed space, and eventually those kicks started to really take an effect on his opponent and slow him down. He has to stay the course next round. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going here. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick.
All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand, jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man. Let this guy have the whole thing. Nice strike. Straight right, he misses. Ooh, looking to set up that head kick. Nice kick. Over and over, he lands big body kick. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Up and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Beautiful level change. Make him think he's going low to come right over the top with that beautiful overhand. Great punch. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Straight right hand now just misses. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Throwing that jab, no good. Oh. Really good body kick. And he comes through with a big knee. Just out of range with that right hook. Straight punch there, DC. He's got it. How's his opponent still stand? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Oh! Not at all. Beautifully timed with the Superman punch. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Good punch, land. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block! There's no tell on that leg kick. Oh, well, you know about his kicks. They are on point this evening. Oh, beautiful jab by him there. Got that to the target quickly. He's dictating the fight with a jab.
right, there's the end of the round. So it was a huge strike to the head that stunned his opponent and, and nearly got him out of it. Yeah, that was a big moment. A big strike lands, his opponent's on wobbly legs. That is exactly what, what you want to see as you're walking back to your school. Your opponent staggering back to his corner and being hopeful that he can get it back together before the start of the next round. Oh, big punch land. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Whip on the elbow. going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch land. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Beautiful leg kick roll. <laughs> Unable to connect with the record. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Well, we wondered earlier why there weren't as many body strikes. He's making up for lost time here. Shot to the body connects, and that bears watching. That's good. Oh, 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 oh. oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. And they separate. You got to check. These low leg kicks. Let's focus. Let's focus now. Out of range with that one. Big leg kick land. Leg kick after leg kick after leg kick. Well, not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. Finish could come here at any time. Oh! He ate that goal. Oh. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, he gets up here, but he is on wobbly legs. Some fighters shy away from him. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, hide, Grab or wrestle. He's, a, he, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. Huh. Wow! He's out! He's done, he's done! What a performance! Yeah, man, crowd loving it. Just a gorgeous shot there to end the fight. Really just the way he drew it up. He found the opening and capitalized on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight. Well, let's take a look back at the replay. It ends up a knockout, but this was really a striking clinic from the moment they touched one. I mean, a competitive fight. That one guy finally found the shot that ended the fight. But both of these warriors displayed a ton of heart. One guy got the finish, but neither guy should be disappointed in their performance. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest. At three minutes, 17 seconds of the third round, declaring the winner by knockout. So well, he's smiling ear to ear, and why not after a knockout like that? I need to take it to the after party tonight. I mean, this is what dreams are made of. You dream of the knockout like this, and then the party after, where you and all your coaches get to celebrate the great handiwork. Checking the trust and getting them hit. The 